Every time that my mind slip, I just see my past life. Have hey, I'm Lindsay with Two Moms Same Hood. Thank you so much for stopping by and checking out my video today. If you are new here, Jen and I are neighborhood besties. We are the creators of Two Moms Same Hood, and we would love it if you guys would hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoy this video, then please make sure to give it a thumbs up. It really means a lot to us. I'm really excited to be collaborating with my friend Audrey. You can find her at oddly.simple. And her channel is so awesome, you guys. She is a mama of two girls and a math teacher. She makes videos on motherhood, cleaning, lifestyle, and more. So please go check out her video to see what Audrey eats in a day and tell her that two moms same hood sent you. The things I've learned from the past when I lost 30 pounds from before is just keep it simple. Do not overthink it. Do not overcomplicate it. So here are the things that I'm going to be doing to help me out on my journey. And the first thing is track every single thing that I eat on my fitness pal. This helps me tremendously because we as moms especially have tendencies to sneak a bite here or there off of your kiddo's plate or we're in the kitchen and we're cooking dinner and we're tasting and all those little bites and licks and tastes add up, right? So. First thing I am doing is tracking everything down in my fitness pal. It's an app on my phone. You can use anything. You can even be old school and just keep a journal and write all of your um, calories and food down on a piece of paper. The next thing, tip number two that I am doing is exercising every day. I love to walk. I live in Southern California. So as long as the weather is nice outside, my exercise of choice or preference is walking and I've been getting out with my three daughters and it's been a really positive thing for us. The third tip that I have is drink lots of water. And I know you guys hear that all the time. Drink water, exercise, count your calories. But those are three things that I've really been neglecting lately and because I have, I've noticed a huge shift in my body and my weight. So those are the three things that I'm going to be sticking to. And I don't think I mentioned before, but my goal is to lose about 30 pounds. And for reference, I'm a shorty. I'm barely five foot three. So any weight that I gain is pretty visible because I have a smaller frame. Without further ado, we are going to jump into today's video. That made you lose your mind. There's no way I can undo what I've done. Can we be strangers again? Start fresh like a morning. What's so bad about that? So why won't you follow? Why won't you follow me home? I know I can't make you mine, yes I ran out of town, there's no hope for me. I fell down the bottom, so I fell down way deep, but if I can have- Good morning, it's about seven o'clock. First thing I always do is come downstairs and take all of my vitamins and my supplements. So let me show you what I take. So, as soon as my feet hit the floor, I take my packet of Thrive Vitamins. I'm about on week two, and I can definitely see a huge difference taking them. My hunger has been reduced. I have more energy. I was a little bit skeptical, but I'm starting to become a believer. So I will keep you guys updated on my results with Thrive. Um, I hope I pronounced this right. Pantothenic acid. It's basically... By, uh, vitamin B and I got this because I'm suffering from adult acne and this is supposed to help with the acne and balancing my hormones so I take this three times a day so once I get my coffee made, then I'm going to sit down and track all of my food that I want to eat inside of my fitness pal, and I'm going to show you guys how I do that. One tip that I do have for you is make sure you log your food in your tracker before you eat it. 
and I'm just gonna be real with you guys. I tried to film this video yesterday and I did not do that. And guess what happened? I ate things that I thought, oh, that's not too many calories. And I went way over <laughs> my calories for the day. So I am starting fresh today, learning from my mistakes from yesterday. So track everything you want before you eat it. It's easy. It only takes a couple of seconds. Trust your girl on this. Dress up and start fresh like a morning But what's so bad about that? So why won't you follow? Why won't you follow me home? I know I can't make you mine Yes, I ran out of time There's no hope for me I fell down the bottom So I fell down way deep But if I can't have the real you Then let me my talk yeah. it's a time to move on but i cannot i shoot in the dark so i miss my talk yeah. it's a time to move on you know so I why can't. won't you follow why won't you follow me home i know i can't make you mind yes i ran out of time there's no hope for me i fell down the bottom so I fell down way deep But if I can't have the real you Then let me make a 3D print And it is about 2 o'clock right now and I'm getting a little bit hungry, so I'm going to be eating a Built Bar. These are one of my absolute favorite protein bars as a snack. You can see the macros right here. 110 calories, 15 grams protein. So that leaves me with 803 remaining calories for the day. And at the top you'll see I did burn 290 calories for my walk this morning and I used my Fitbit to keep track of that. I'll show you that in just a second. Okay, it is almost four o'clock. I'm getting really hungry. I don't wanna eat too much because it's gonna be dinner soon. So I'm going to have two of these caramel rice cakes. They're 50 calories each, so this is a 100 calorie snack. And. All right, I have ended the day at 1,768 calories. If you take account my exercise, whoops, hang on. Um, I did good, I have 97 calories left. I'm full, I probably won't eat that. Um, my carnitas quesadilla, the total for that was 510 calories, and that is it. Thanks so much for watching today's video. And if you have any food items that you recommend, any tips or tricks, I'd love to hear what has worked for you in the past. And if you want to join me along my journey, then please follow us over on Instagram and use the hashtag, hashtag join our fit hood. We'd love to have you guys follow along and build a community of supportive women. So I hope everyone is staying safe and healthy. I hope you guys have a blessed day. Bye.